You know, a lot of times people ask me how I stay so positive all the time. And the answer is that I, I don't. I face the same self-doubt and imposter syndrome as everybody else. In fact, I tell people that I've probably been rejected more than the average person because I've taken more risks than the average person. I moved to Los Angeles with a single suitcase and sold everything I own. For the past two years, I've been coaching and speaking and getting media appearances all myself with no team behind me. All that stuff is downright scary sometimes. So I understand what it's like to face failure. I understand what it's like to want to throw in the towel pretty much every single day because you don't think what you're doing is ever going to get to the point that you want to do it. But I've noticed there are two things that you really need to focus on. It's not about positivity, it's about focus. And if you can stay disciplined, if you can stay deliberate and purposeful in your actions, you don't always need to be positive because you'll be getting results. The two things that I always focus on are, what would my life look like if I do succeed? And I know some people will say that you have to say when you succeed, stay positive, stay positive. Well, you know what? Not everybody makes it. So you have to be realistic and confident enough to know that you can succeed, but humble enough to understand that you also may fail. So I always keep the vision in my mind of what will my life look like if I do succeed. And that doesn't just mean material things, it means freedom, it means being able to make an impact on the world, it means living a certain life the way that I choose to live it. And next, I focus on what would life look like if I gave up? What are the alternatives? Where would I be working? What would I be doing? What kind of life would I be living? And I've experienced some of those alternatives before and it's not what I want for myself which is why it shows the path that I'm on right now. So staying clear and defining with absolute clarity what you want your life to look like. What does that person look like? If the future you in 10 years came into the room right now and had a conversation with you, what would that be like? And keeping such a clear focus on that that you cannot help but continue no matter what challenges come your way. And then understanding that if you were to give up, not only would all of the work right now be for nothing, but where would that leave you? What kind of life would you end up living? And is that really what you're okay with? So focus on those two things. And do me a favor, let me know in the comments, what goals are you working towards right now? And how could somebody out there maybe help you? You never know who might see the comment and be able to reach out. So let me know what you're focused on because I believe in your opportunities. I believe in your abilities to do it because I'm just an average person like everybody else who is too stubborn to give up. So thank you guys, like this video, share it with somebody who needs it, hit the subscribe button, follow me at James M. Sama, and let's chat more about this. Let me know how else I can help you. Thanks guys, take care.